there's a new chatbot in town taking on OpenAI, and it's not Google Gemini. <laughs> hey everyone, it's Chris McKay from Imaginative with some exciting news from Mistral AI. Mistral? Mistral. How do you pronounce it? Let's just get this out of the way. My French sucks, and I'm, I'm going to absolutely butcher these names but I'm still going to try. So for those of you that don't know, Mistral AI is a relatively new player on the scene. They popped up last September with their model Mistral 7B and it turned a lot of heads, mostly because of how it was released. They released basically a magnet link for a torrent download and they didn't have any safety precautions or guardrails in it like Llama or ChatGPT. Basically, if you access something, it will tell you. But their biggest release actually came later in the year in December when they released Mistral which was a mixture of experts architecture that left all the open models in its class and many of the commercial ones in the dust. Now today the French startup has announced that it is releasing a cool new assistant called the chat, an incredibly advanced model called Mr. Large and a huge partnership with Microsoft. And it's just Monday. Let's get into it. So first up, Mistral unveiled the chat. It's a conversational assistant, just like ChatGPT or Gemini assistant that you can use to interact with any of the underlying models. It's only currently available in beta, but you can sign up for the waitlist. Luckily for you, we already have access and we've been putting it through its paces. And so here's a first look at the chat. As you can see, the user interface is pretty standard. It's similar to what we've come to expect from most of these tools. You can have conversations in five languages, English, French, German, Spanish, and Italian. So that's pretty cool. On the left, you can see a history of your chats and you can delete a chat or jump back and forth between your conversations. There's dark mode and light mode. And then finally, in the upper right corner, you can easily switch between the different models. So overall, it's a very solid chatbot. However, the underlying model is what makes this release very special, Mistral Large. The company says Mistral Large is the second most capable commercially available model, second only to OpenAI's GPD-4. That's a massive deal, especially considering all the press that Gemini has been getting lately. Specifically though, Mistral Large totally dominates the benchmarks when it comes to reasoning, knowledge, coding, math, and cross-lingual capabilities. Now, it only has a 32,000 token window, so it's not as large as Anthropic's 200,000 or Gemini's 1.5, 1 million, but it's going to be plenty enough for most casual users. Now, the last piece of news was Mistral agreeing to deliver all its models, including Mistral Large, directly on Microsoft Azure. They announced a multi-year partnership. That is mind boggling. Like Azure customers can now access Mr. Large through Azure Studio and Azure Machine Learning. Microsoft now has exclusive access to GPT and also first dibs on Mistral. How is it that Google and Amazon fail to get in early? Well done, Microsoft, well done. So overall, a great series of announcements and an awesome week for Mistral AI. Let me know what you think of Mistral Large and if you get a chance to try the chat. And smash that like button if you're as excited as I am for the future of AI. Until next time, one love.